Hi, I am a bullet student tutor, and today we're going to solve a problem about areas and distance. Given the function's graph as following, our goal is to use six rectangles to find the estimate of each type of the area under the given graph of f from x equals 0 to x equals 12. The first type is L6. Sample points are left end points. So let's make a number line here. From 0 to 12. So we're using 6 rectangles. So we can divide 0 to 12 into 6 rectangles. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and 12. Our left end points are L1, L2, L3, L4, L5, L6. And our right end points are R1, R2, oops, R3, R4, R5 and R6. The midpoints are in the middle. So here M1, M2, M3, M4, M5, M6. So first of all, we need to find the area under the curve using left endpoints. Therefore, L, L6 equals to the width times height. So it's 2 times F of 0 plus 2 times F of 2 plus 2 times F of 4 plus 2 times f of 6 plus 2 times f of 8 times 2 plus 2 times f of 10. Using this function, you should get 86.6 as your answer. Second part is to use right endpoints to find the area under the curve. So we do the same thing except we use right endpoints. So width times height, this time we start from f of 2 plus 2 times f of 4 plus 2 times f of 6 plus 2 times f of 8 plus 2 times f of 10 plus 2 times f of 12. Using this equation, you should get the answer of 70.6. Now we need to use the midpoints to find the area under the curve. So as we can see from the number line that m1 is just 1, m2 is 3, M3 is 5, M4 is 7, M5 is 11, and oh, whoops, M5 is 9, M6 is 11. So using these midpoints, we can find the area under the curve using width times height. So we do F02 oh, times F of 1 plus 2 times f of 3, plus 2 times f of 5, plus 2 times f of 7, plus 2 times f of 9, plus 2 times f of 11. Using this equation, you should get the answer of 79.4. So the second question is, is L6 an underestimate or overestimate of the true area? So we can look at the um, functions graph and see using left endpoints, 
we get the area under the curve which is which is more than the actual area so left using left end points we get overestimate and using right endpoints we get the area that is a little lesser than the actual area so using right endpoints we get underestimate And using midpoints, we get the area is like this. Which is in between L1 and R L6 and R6, which is more accurate. So L um, using M6, we find the most accurate answer, the best estimate.